Putting today, New York Congressman Hakeem Jeffries is on the verge of making history on Capitol Hill. He is expected to be elected as House Minority Leader, making him the first black man to hold a top party leadership role in Congress. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller is live in Park Slope with more. Good morning, Derek. Shirlene, good morning. And Brooklyn's in the House and the Senate because for the first time, the Democratic leaders of both houses of Congress will actually be from Kings County. And that includes uh, Hakeem, Hakeem Jeffries. The vote for the next House Minority Leader is expected to happen today. And Congressman Jeffries is running unopposed. The 52 year old would make history as the first black speaker, or I should say, the uh, first uh, black uh, minority leader, a product of New York City public schools. And he's replacing Nancy. Nancy Pelosi, who is 82 years old. On CNN, Jeffrey said he looks forward to working with Republicans who just narrowly won control of the House in this year's midterms. I haven't had a conversation with uh, Leader McCarthy recently. I look forward to working uh, whenever and wherever possible, however, Jake, with the entire House Republican Conference and the leadership team to find common ground to get things done for everyday Americans. And so Jeffries is expected to win the gavel despite some objections from members of his party who are on the left. Uh, they say he's not sufficiently liberal. In fact, uh, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, his uh, fellow Democrat here in New York, uh, she has not yet publicly endorsed him. Reporting live here.